My dear sweet friends that are so dear and sweet to me, like my dear sweet precious Pokemon, that Batumbus has absolutely never abused. How dare you suggest otherwise? The low karma is incidental. He is not a thief, and he is not a bad guy, depending on your definition of bad guy, which would have to be incredibly lax. Today, we have a lot on our plate. So I'm pre-recording this episode because I've got a lot on my plate in real life as well. Need a day just to kind of do a lot of real life stuff, admin work and other such, such stuff. Uh, however, we have uh, not one, not two, not three or four or five, but in fact, six Pokemon on the verge of leveling up. One more level for Joris, Matchup, Father, and Slackoff will evolve them to their later forms. Father can technically, I suppose, evolve twice because we've got Linking Cord. So not only can it become a Blastoise, but we could also hit with a Linking Cord and finish that off straight away. Slackoth and Matchup obviously both have two more evolutions beyond the match. So does Joris, now that I think about it. We are going to keep it as Teddy Ursa, though. Nidorino and Weeping Tress both just need the stones in my pocket, but we're going to do it all in one fell swoop. So then... Where do we go now? We go to Saffron? Oh, well, I suppose we go back to uh, uh, Lavender Town, of course, to resolve that aspect. But I think one more battle. Oh, no, when he, when he gets 35, it actually locks him in there. Fair enough. So a few more battles, a little bit of, uh, a little bit of combat, and we should be able to uh, level every single party member up. So why don't we just carry on then as per usual? Go to Lavender Town and start saving uh, Mount Fuji, as they call him, as I've called him incorrectly several times. <laughs> I'm not going to stop calling him that, to be honest with you. And we're going to uh, hopefully evolve all of them along the way. Now that we've got the Sylph Scope, we defeated Erica very handily. Defeated uh, George Varney, leader of Team Rocket, not so handily. Oh, they weren't Pokemon. It was old women all along. Oh, God, it was grandmas. They weren't the spirits of Pokemon. It was actually everybody's grandma. Bulbatly. Bulbatly is a great name. That's borderline Rimworld level of name. Cool Sprite as well. We're going to use Father, because of course he's got the Psychic moves, and more importantly, he's got the Biting moves. Go super effective against Psychic, and then Psychic super effective. Oh, Possessed by a Spirit, I understand. So I was kind of right both ways. Um, We want a Gengar, don't we, of course. Why am I even asking? Of course we want a Gengar. Should we wait until we get a Haunter? Haunters can appear rarely. Go super effective on Psychic, but Dark super effective on Ghost? Absolutely. I've got it the right way around in my head. Psychic not super effective on Ghost, then. I don't know what I thought it was. It would make sense, right? For Psychic could... Although, no, I suppose it makes sense maybe Ghost is super effective against Psychic because they're susceptible to that. They're actually attuned to that. Charlie. Oh, I see what's happening here. These are cool. These are these are really interesting designs. Wait, why did that one not affect it? Because it's Fire Poison? I guess it must be if it's a Ghastly, right? Okay, fair enough. So what we've got to bear, bear in mind with Gengar, though, is obviously, well, uh, oh, Father wants to learn Psychic. Psychic's bloody good, right? 90? Yeah. Go to Psybeam. I mean, I like Psybeam because it's got the very off chance of confusion, but I think we just want pure damage. Someone in the comment section last episode did. Oh, here we go. Father is evolving. So this is going to be a Kadabra Blastoise. At level 40, they evolve naturally, so maybe I'll just save it. He's only two levels off. That actually looks really cool. Somehow you've made that not look too weird, given that it's kind of a, kind of an odd combination, a middle evolution and an end evolution of a starter. They're both iconic though, aren't they? Kinesis. Ah, uh, no. You're okay. Hydro Pump, I take. What level does a Blastoise learn a Hydro Pump? The spirits here are up to mischief. Aren't they just flooding my kitchen and flipping over my bins? That's just in real life. Squirtly. Nah, not into that. Grandma, I don't want to see your squirtly, actually. Ah. Uh, maybe Psychic is super effective on Ghost. <laughs> is Psychic super effective on... No, it's poison! It's poison! You just answered this! Idiot. This is probably where I've got this confusion in my head from, from childhood of going through this tower with a Psychic type and being like, okay, well, Psychic clearly works on Ghost, when in fact they're all just poison types. Gasicate. Okay, so this one is 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 ghost normal. Ah, don't do that. There. Right. You see, I'm locked in now. I'm dialed in. I'm, a, I'm above board in my lane thriving. I understand. Don't like the fact there was a ghost of a girl there. Kind of freaking me out. Hi, Grandma. I must have been dreaming. You're off your medicine again. Oh, that music. Jesus, that scared the hell out of me. It's got a really good soundstage. I genuinely thought that was coming from behind me in real life. That scared the fucking shit out of me. Great work. I thought I had something playing through my, uh, my, my computer speakers or something like that then for a second. God damn. Found an awakening. I wish. I haven't had enough caffeine today. 
specifically trying to wean myself off of it again. Dotsy keeps telling me, you've got too much caffeine in your life. And I keep trying to stop it. And then I stop it and I have a horrendous headache. And then I say, well, maybe just today so I can keep working. That drowsy was level 35. That was a wild drowsy level 35. What the hell? Well, hello, haunted girl. Haunted girl or haunting girl? So she's a real girl that is haunted, I think. She's not like a, not like a spirit. Okay, so we can just use... Psychic on you. I love these glass cannon fights. They're super effective against us. We're super effective against us. This is a cool combo. Uh, but it's in a gas bra. Mm, don't need to know about it. Oh, Jesus. Okay, not very effective. Because it's gas bra. You've got that the wrong way around in your brain again. Do a little bite. I thought Dark was super effective on psychic. Again, the whole... Me it's just a mess in my head. I'll, I'll look up the types at some point. Right. If we see a Haunter, we catch it. Cubone. Oh, I don't really like Cubones. I know a lot of people like Cubones. I'm not really into it personally. So I'm going to kill that one to really just, you know, let it know it's in the wrong neighborhood. Pokey Radar. Haunter and what is that final one? Miss Magius? Are they called that? Or is that the evolved form? Oh my God, it's a ghastly in a cloud. It's a, it's a drowsy in... You knew what I meant. Shut up. Droughtly. I can hit you with the Psychic then. Beautiful. Yeah, no, I mean, if we see any more, like, level 35... I mean, Hypno, again, I like the idea of eventually finishing the game with a cursed party. Very edgy. Very cursed. Can we got low karma we're collecting feathers for? Again, I assume Dark Ray. Gassed. As in, I ran up the stairs too fast, and now I'm gassed. Uh, bite. I know time matchups. It's a basic part of the game. Why wouldn't I know that? I love the fact it's got the, the water in one hand and the spoon in the other. It's a cool, cool little feature. I'm pretty sure that the chance of a Haunter are higher the higher up the tower you go, but I might also be bullshitting you there. Don't listen to my nonsense. Level 27, maybe we can get a higher level gas than that. Don't do it. Please don't sucker punch me. But anyway, we're trying to also train up and evolve every other Pokemon in the party. Did I turn back on the EXP share? Yes, I did. Okay, good. That would be embarrassing. Spell tag, what does that do? Is that ghost type moves? Uh, hello there. Spell tag. Oh, interesting. Um, I, I also should worth pointing out, again, I've got that lucky incense on, on Kadabra instead of the Twisted Spoon. So we'll probably swap open eventually. Uh, swap open, swap over eventually. Why don't I take the amulet coin away? What did I do? Why have I not put the amulet coin back on my guy? Oh, I must have forgotten. What does the spell tag do? I, I really have no idea. Where is that? Pokeballs? Uh, well, it's definitely not a berry. Not a male. Uh, I, I, I'm not... Oh, spell tag. There it is. Boost the power of ghost moves. We already had one. Oh, shit. Okay, cool. Right. Upstairs we go. Oh, dear. Hello, spooky grandma. Give me blood. This is a children's game. Golter. That's cool. I like that. Dalta, uh, you hit it with a psychic, it dies. God damn, he's sweeping. Father's sweeping. Are you telling me... Sorry, how long have I not had... Oh, God, explosion. Ah, uh, fuck it. Yeah, we ball. Quite literally, because it's very round. Get rid of sweet scent. <laughs> what a... What a what a change of lane there, huh? What was I about to say? Have I maybe not had amulet corn equipped this entire time? Hmm... Matchup is evolving. Hey, good news. There's one of six. But anyway, we can turn it into a matchup immediately if we hit it with that link cable. But again, level 40 is going to evolve, I think, anyway. So we might as well just hold out. Matchup evolved into Macho. Sprite by Game Freak. No one's made an alternate Macho, really. Oh, no, loads of people have. That's a Lady Macho. Uh, I'm going to go with... God, there's so many. What's in his hand? What is that? Are those like counterweights? Is that what that's supposed to be? Uh, wow, there's so many. Oh, my God. I want to go for the one that is, uh, holding the weights. Oh, that one's, that one's huge. Look at that guy. Huge, swole. Goddamn, pumped. <laughs> Hi there. Come play with us. Oh, why did it get so creepy, floor five? What happened? Holy shit. Gas cue. Oh. 
Oh, it's sad. Oh, it tells a story. Great gameplay. I'm going to hit you with the uh, the bite, though. Please stop doing that. My father won't survive much more of these. Beautiful. Great work. Well, we've got the restoration zone growing up. Joris goes to level 36. Okay, this is very important that we, we are very careful with how we do this. Because Joris can evolve the head and the body. Oh my god, which way around did I do it? Oh my god, I don't remember which way around I did it. Oh shit. Steel, steel ghost. So I think we evolved the head. I think. Oh, if I get this wrong, it becomes an Ursa ring and I'll cry. Well, let's try it. And if it looks like it's going to be massive, we cancel. Go. I think we're safe. I think we're safe. <gasps> I think we're safe. I think it would be a lot bigger if it was a nursery. ring. Okay. Ooh. You look like Sheik. Oh. Little sword Pokemon. It licks its palms that are sweetened by being soaked in honey. The complex attack patterns of the two swords are unstoppable even for an opponent. Gives it that grip. Uh, on, the, on the swords. Come on. Sorry, I've got to be so careful with what I, all Pokemon fans are like. Uh, not learn charm. Very good. You dip your hands in honey, then you can hold the swords better. Entered purified protected zone. Great. Come, child. I sealed this space with white magic. It's just cocaine. Just sprinkled it on the floor. Aerosolized it. The devil's bong. What a girl. Car Carol Ann. Carol Space Ann. Oh, that's a name. Uh, <laughs> it's the baseball game where it was made by a Japanese studio. They couldn't remember the they, they didn't they didn't like no good convincing American names. Hold on, Japanese baseball. I want to say like Bo Horvat was on there. Japanese baseball game names. Hold on. Oh yeah, Bobson Dugnut. That's it. Bobson Dugnut. You've got uh, Sleeve McDykel. <laughs> <laughs> Onsen Shwimi. These are great Rimworld names. These are great Rimworld names. Todd Gonzalez. Jeremy Gerd. God damn, I'm going to write those down. Don't tell anyone I'm doing this, okay? And I'll do this in a series and we'll see what happens. Uh, who am I going with you then? Uh, I like that one. Looks a little goofy. That one is like... Oh, look, he's doing the Marge Crunk. i got to go with that one. <laughs> wild monkey Pokemon? What is a sloth? What the fuck do you mean, wild monkey Pokemon? It's quite obviously a sloth. I don't disagree with the game there. Right, excuse me, Ghastly, we're, we're busy. I'll catch a good Haunter. What are the herbs? Give me your soul? Give me your blood? I don't think Batumbus has a soul. That's scary. I don't like that. Um... Droughter. We're fine. We're fine. I think Bite would have been super fancy, but again, I don't know. I don't know this well enough to commit to it. Do the safe bet. Good shit. And I think we're pretty much done with that. I was under possession. How long have I been in here? It's been 40 years. I'm sorry. Ooh. That's a cool fusion. A Gengar Marowak, you know, would go hard. Enter a purified... What if you do, like, Cubone Kangaskhan? Because there's, like, obviously that belief that Cubone is a Kangaskhan. Like, fan theories. Fanon. Clefgar. Yeah, like, like, Clef Clefable and Gengar. This is another classic one, isn't it? Uh, I'm going to hit you with a... Clefgar. Psychic. The right turns out that's weak against Fairy. How am I supposed to know these things? With my psychic... Key! What's going on? I want to go home. I'm not helping you out. You're on your own. Hello there. God, look at the way she, like, floats over. I like that. Challenged by Channeler Amelia Horn Trio. What is that? Oh! That's so cool. Why? I feel like everyone's got cooler Pokemon than me. I feel like I've really missed something here. Beautiful. I was very fortunate that was a critical hit. Right. Uh, something fell out. What do you mean something fell out? Hair didn't fall out. It was an evil spirit. Oh, right. Is it going to be the Marowak? Oh, or it's just a, the ghost of a girl. Maybe that too. Haunted girl. Question mark. Question mark. Genwak. Oh, there it is. Okay. You read my mind. 
Or Genwak, I suppose. Ah, uh, Gen Whack. Bite. Level fucking 40, my guy. Shadow Bone. Well, sometimes you're not feeling it. Keep the light off. Let's go for, uh... Oh, dear. I don't have a party capable of this. Joris. Why Joris? Night Slash. <laughs> We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. Don't panic. Trust in, trust in Joris. I have a potion Joris. I, uh, should I max revive father? Maybe. Maybe. I trust in Joris. <laughs> Can we... We're, we're not faster, are we? So if I do that, he's probably just going to die. I'm going to... Yeah. I, don't know. I knew we won. I said it out loud. And still, I was like, you know what? Oh, it's got a little Marowax on its puppet string. Did you notice that? That's clever. Okay, Weeping Tress. Knock off. You are never going to take this guy down. He is the tankiest Pokemon you've ever seen in your life. Beautiful. Good shit. Thank you, Weeping Tress. God damn, that was a lot of XP. Holy shit. My to 37 wants to learn submission. Is submission good? Uh, 80 80. Hurts the user slightly. There you go. I should have not learned submission. 37 for Nina Rhino. Oh, still no evolutions elsewhere. Who else are we waiting on at this point? Bloody hell, I was laggy. Oh, that one was actually a, a girl. That, uh, well, like a spirit of a girl. Um, oh, no, everything's evolved. Yeah, no, you're right. Everything's evolved. Don't listen to me. Obviously, Vigoroth needs a couple more levels. Um, let's hit him with some stones then, huh? And we'll probably go downstairs and heal up. Leave stone on the weeping tress. Oh, there is actually a sprite for it. Good shit. I was a little worried it might just be a randomly generated one. Oh, there's not. Oh, fuck. Oh, there's not. Oh, no. <laughs> well, I mean, who's combining these two Pokemon? Come on. Oh, Mirror Shot's good. Yeah, we like Mirror Shot. Okay, let's get rid of... Uh... Acid. Whatever. Oh, no. We'll still an Automatize. Is that good? Oh, no. I can't be bothered with that. You're fine. We'll still learn Tornado. That sounds sick. What does Tornado do? Oh, it's Leaf Tornado. Oh... Ooh, ah, I don't have a Pokemon with hypnosis right now. This might be a mistake for catching wild Pokemon, but you know what? I'm going to go with it. I've used up my last leaf stone. That's fine. And then we'll use the Moonstone on Moonstone, Moonstone, Moonstone on uh, Nidorino. Gives us half the king. Oh, actually, there was no need to do this. Nido king. King, king. Yeah, there was no need to do this. Because bear in mind, I was going to fuse it with Kingler. So we had King King, but we can't unfuse the, the, the Meowth. Whoa, look at that one. What the hell? Look at a big old T-Rex. Okay, which one do I like the most? Oh, he's got a lot of sprites. I understand why. God damn. God damn. There are so many sprites. I like that one because it's so over the top. Hell yeah. God damn. I'm into that. Okay, good shit. Linking cord. Just go for the match amp. No, stick with it. We might be able to sell those for a high price. You never know. I've got so many Pokemon that need... Like... Oh, you can just catch a Gengar. What the fuck? Oh, no. This is a bad time matchup. Dragon. Oh, yeah? You think you're anything is bad matchup? How about one of those? Boom. This... We're just about to catch Pokemon that's, like, stronger than half my fucking team. <laughs> this is good. 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 We hit him with the Ultra Ball. Because I found one. You just catch a Gengar. That feels so weird. Come on. No! Do I have any sort of status effect at all in this squad? Yawn. I think I've got Yawn. Okay. Dream Eater. Good try. Yawn. Meow. Yay, they kept the noise. Uh, don't do anything. Just bide your time. Just don't do anything. You might as well start chucking balls while we wait for it to fall asleep. Get it? That's never going to catch. Never. 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 Told you. I told you it wouldn't. Shadow ball. Fall asleep, you big bitch. Yes. Okay. Now we're into some stuff. Come on. Boom. Okay. That's good fusion fodder. I like that. Fuck, maybe we got like Gengar Machamp. Wild card. Whoa, what happened to that Gengar? Oh, it's like a shiny one, isn't it? I thought the shiny color was white. Maybe that's like the Alolan Gengar or whatever the hell that is. Oh, there's so many iconic Gengars here. That's, um, 
like the Sabrina's uh, Sabrina's Gengar card art, right? I know that because I. Listen, I'm not getting into it. You'll, you'll be like, oh, what a hyper nerd. I got a proxy deck in Magic the Gathering of like, po it's Pokemon themed. Instead of running swamps, I run uh, the basic psychic energy, and I've put it all in yellow sleeves so it looks like old 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 style Pokemon cards. That's all. That's how cool I am. Bet you're fucking well jealous now. I'm gonna put it in the dress. Yeah, all right. <laughs> Why is that a thing? Uh, Storing the PC. Well, that's ticked off the Gengar. That was a big one. Cool. I, I didn't expect that. Oh, yeah, look at that. So it haunts that we haven't encountered, nor have we encountered, again, I think it's Mistrevious. Mr. Magus is the, uh, the evolution. I know these things. I don't know if we're strong enough to come up here and save Mount Fuji yet. I mean, our only good Pokemon in this party, are, uh, I mean, other than things that we're just kind of leveling up for, potential fusions, is just like, what, Father and... Let's be honest, probably just that. I think that the Victory Bell is um, pretty dreadful. I think Victory Victory Tress is pretty awful. Joris could do some good work because he's got that dart move. Honestly, I'm, maybe Nido King's all right. Let's see what happens. Ooh, is that another one of those prisms? Ooh, the four missing prisms. We found a couple. Oh, okay. We found two, I believe. You find them in like caves. Okay. Oh, cool. I'm glad they have a quest of this. I wonder what this leads to. So we got like two really... See, I assumed it would be Deoxys because it looked very similar to the... I wonder if it's like Giratina or something. I'm trying to think like edgy ghost Pokemon that like needs a lot of stuff. Where first moonlight bathed the land, a prism rests where stones meet sand. Within a tunnel deep and wide, find the prism where stones hide. Okay, so we found those two. Where psychic echoes resonate, a prism waits beyond mine's gate. Saffron? It's not, not going to give you... I, I mean, obviously, Giratina will be a terrible guess because it's like Kanto. Psychic resonates, a prism... Oh, 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 I bet that's uh, the cave where you find Mewtwo. Because we found them all in caves so far. So that's got to be Cerulean Cave. Mr... Torrent's rushing flow. The final prisms like there's got torrents rushing. Could that be uh the Articuno caves? It could be uh the Lugia one. Whirlpool Islands. Whirl Islands, I think they're just called. Interesting. Okay. A lead leads to what though? What does that give you? Fuck knows. I guess we'll find out. It's gotta be some sort of ghost type. But I think we're already doing like the dart right quest. So who knows? Hi, fella. Oh, hello, Batumbus. You came to save me. I must thank you for your concern. These Team Rocky grunts came looking for the blueprint of the Master Ball. I'm afraid I was no match for them. They took what they were looking for. I'm truly worried about what such an evil organization could do with such a powerful tool. Using innocent Pokemon for money. Batumbus, your Pokemon Pokedex quest may fail without love for your Pokemon. I think this may help you for your quest. I love my Pokemon. I just love other Pokemon as well. So much that I'm going to take them for my own. Is there a mod for this that lets you do like, you know, like, um... Pokemon Coliseum, where you get the Shadow Pokemon, you use the Snagum machine or whatever the fuck it was called. Has my duty flute helped you? Oh, there's no, there's no fight up here. I guess they moved the Giovanni fight under Celadon instead. Or uh, no, it's, you do fight Team Rocket up here. I even thought there was a rival fight, but I guess I don't remember. Gaster. Oh, we can just like escape rope out, can't we? We might as well. Unless there's something down here. I, I don't think there's gonna be anything else at this point, is there? Right, let's get out. Good work today, squad. Hey, great progress. How does that work? You just trick that, trick that bitch out the window. You just climb down. People don't think you're a weirdo. I don't think that's how that goes. Have we got more evil? What does the side of the screen look like? I think it looks about the same, doesn't it? Great. Okay. Well, let's look at some fusions then. Wow. So, uh, Gengar. Obviously, basic bitch. What about just like Gengar Duskull? Double down. I mean, like... Dusk Noir, Dragonite would be cool. Gengar Dragonite would be cool. Oh, there's so much potential. Um, if I, I'm not going to go for edgy party yet. We're still going kind of silly, which is why we're going for like King King and Joris. Nido King, <coughs> I think you're going into retirement. This is the box of fusions. We're not using this box of eggs. I'm gonna I'm gonna start retiring Pokemon that I'm probably just never going to do anything with. Here's the plays, right? Very simple. I'm just going to go uh, a little bit based on type matchup, a little bit based on coolness, right? 
So first things first, uh, I, I did some, I, I, I found this Pokemon type calculator, because again, I, I don't know this shit. Dragon Water has surprisingly very, very few weaknesses. So I think we take, I think we, I, I think we defuse Kadabra Blastoise. Let's, let's unfuse you. And then I'm going to go Blastoise Dragonite, wild card. I'm not a big fan of Blastoise as a Pokemon. I mean, it's cool. It's a turtle with cannons. That is an interesting combo. So let's do that. Water Dragon, Dragon Water. It doesn't really matter. Neither has a custom sprite. Oh, no. Um, I'm actually really quite surprised about that. Really? I guess because people like maybe have like Squirtle or Dratini. Um, Dragon Water, Water Dragon. I don't think it really matters, does it? Oh, but eventually it'll become Dragon Flying. So I guess we want to go with that one. Yeah. This is going to be the body of a Blastoise with, what, the head of a Dratini? Which, I don't remember which way around this is, but... Oh. Oh, brother. Ooh. Brother. No. Shellfish Dragon Pokemon. Okay, we need to level you up fast. May heal its own status problem. That's pretty solid. Bashful. Higher special attack, lower regular attack. Ooh. Okay. Okay. No, I don't think we need to combine movesets. Although, I'll take a fucking Thunder Wave. I just said we haven't got any status givers. Um, get rid of Rapid Spin. Give Dragon... Oh, Dragon Rage. Was that like 40? Yeah. Oh. Always inflicts 40. I mean, that does 40 and also makes them flinch. Yeah, no, we're good on Dragon Rage. Dragon Rage is like really good early game, right? But then maybe not so crazy later. Okay. Dratoise right now. Horrifying. I promise you, let it cook. Let it cook. Okay. So then I think... Uh, what, what does Porygon Z become? Psychic? Normal psychic? Normal dark? I have no idea. Oh my god, it's just normal. I'll be honest. I think... Sometimes I really do. Gengar Porygon Z. Ghost normal. It's only weak to dark. It takes no damage from normal fighting ghost. It takes half damage from poison bug. Normal damage from everything else besides dark. That could be cool. So I'm going to do that. There's good type matchups. We're, we're, doing some, we're doing some good work today. It needs to be ghost normal. Oh, but it's got an actual sprite the other way around. Oh, come on. That's so typical, isn't it? Ghost normal is the better matchup. It's, the, it's just a better type matchup. So that's what we're going for. Even though it's going to look hideous. That's what we're going for. I'm sure when it evolves. Again, I'm sure when we get like Porygon Zeke. <laughs> Oh, God. <coughs> oh, God. That's just caused physical and mental damage. Oh, no. Download or meditate. Adjust power according to first defenses. That sounds cool. I like that. Means his ground time moves pass. We haven't got worry about ground time moves, really. Anyway, have we? Special attack or... Oh, special attack. Yeah, please. Yeah. Because then we could do... What's that Porygon move? It's like not signal beam. Maybe it is signal beam. I, I think it's got, like, a special move, right? Um, okay. Magnet Rise. What does that do? Oh, it gives immunity to... Yeah, no, we go. Get rid of that. Payback. Uh, payback's fine. Uh, if this user moves after the target, the attack's power will be doubled. I can't imagine it's going to be a particularly fast Pokemon. Let's get rid of Agility. Shadow Ball. Let's get rid of Payback. <laughs> Dream Eater. I love it. We should go to the Move Racer and give it Hypnosis, so I finally got a move I can do something with there. So let's throw, uh, let's throw Dream Eater over a cover. And let's go get Hypnosis for this. Oh, fuck. Well, I've got two so far with no sprites. Of course, I have to start going Esoteric. Then, what am I going to do with Kadabra? We've already got a ghost type, so I really can't use Duskull anymore. I've, I've kind of, unless Dusk Noir is like a dual type. It's going to be Fighting Psychic. That has twice, uh, so two times damage from Flying Ghost Fairy. Everything else, normal. What is Stella? Oh, this calculator's got something called Stella. What the hell is that? Is that a new thing? What would even be a Stella type? Like, what Pokemon's from outer space? Deoxys? Other than that, I can't think of any. Crazy. I don't I just really do not know anything about this. Okay. These are, of course, going to have custom sprites. It's it's two of the most iconic Gen 1 Pokemon combined, right? Level 30. Uh, psychic Fighting, Fighting, Psychic. What do we want to go for? I think we want the special attack on the head and then the physical stats on the body. So Psychic Fighting makes perfect sense. 
Because one's got super high special, one's got super high physical, right? Beautiful. Oh, shit. It's me. He's got the best of both worlds. Big brain, big brawn. It's like looking in a goddamn mirror. Superpower side Pokemon. That's right. No guard. Or synchronize. Uh... No guard. I'm in. Plus defense. Lower special attack. Neutral. Let's say neutral. Because he's quite a neutral Pokemon. Quite a neutral Pokemon. Recover. But garbage. Never would use it. Uh, telekinesis. Garbage. Never use it. Give me Psybeam back. I like... No! Give me Psychic! Yes! Thank you. Finally. What a lineup, though. Okay, let's get rid of... Um... Guaranteed not to miss. Well, we've, we've already... We might as well get rid of Ice Throw. Because the benefit of Ice Throw is it doesn't miss. We've got, we've got his nature that does that. So here's the party, then. Here's the lineup, my friends. Oh, we've lost Teleport. Oh, fuck. Here's the party for now. I guess I'll begrudgingly bring along this fucking hideous thing. <laughs> so hold on. We've got Dragon Water, Ghost Normal, Psychic Fighting, Fire Electric, Steel Normal. Ah, we've got a dual type. We've got two types overlapping there, haven't we? What if I reverse it? Then it becomes Normal Ghost, which we've already got. Oh, Joris, you might be letting the side down. I mean, we'll see how Gengon comes out. If Gengon comes out terrible and, and Joris comes out amazing with Aegislash, Slash, then obviously I'm going to I'm gonna keep one over the other. Fine. Okay. Good lineup. What am I going to do with... Uh, so that's going to be Kinky. That's going to be Kingdra plus Slacking. We probably... Okay, so Kingdra plus Slacking means it'll be Water Normal, which means we might want to... Oh, God, we're going to have some overlap again. Listen, I can't be held accountable for my hopes and dreams. Let's move on. Jesus, I feel like that is getting worse. Oh, no. Hi there. Uh, the next one, more towards me. We've got to go to uh, Fuchsia to take that one off. Can we go to Fuchsia now? I think we do go to Fuchsia now, don't we? Oh, maybe we're okay. I've got to go to the name racer and give back Teleport. Otherwise, we're, we're, we're walking the whole way. Oh, shit. Okay. No, it's HM in this, correct? It is, thank God. Sorry, I had to disappear there because I had a delivery. Now I'm not sure what the hell we were doing. Right, we're going to teleport with this strange man. Oh, God. So when it hits level 40, I presume both parts of the body can evolve simultaneously. Let's lead the party with somebody we know can keep it down for a little while, huh? And I guess, without further ado, the cycling road? I'll be honest, I want to get... Oh, right, of course. Uh, what are we looking at in terms of balls? Because we're going to ultra balls right now. 17 great balls. I guess I'll go to the name racer first. Oh, what am I going to do? Put uh, put Snorlax to sleep. Yeah, good one. Right, let's try this then. Let's see if... We, I mean, we've got Dream Eater, so this should work. I'll save it the next one if we don't catch this one. How about that? I, I don't think it's necessary. I'm not going to... I doubt I'll do any save and reloading for any Pokemon catching unless it's like specifically a legendary we're going for. Oh, it's such a mess. It's such a mess, isn't it? I'm going to hit you with a Psybeam. Okay. Failed on the snore. He's got leftovers. Right, they do have leftovers, don't they? That's right. Okay, I think we just keep going with the side beam then. Until it eventually goes to sleep. Oh, don't do that. How dare you. <laughs> okay, well, so much for that plan then, eh? Okay, there goes Gengar. Very good. Out of the fight now. Right, okay. We've got that flute though, right? That, that wakes them up. The blue flute. That's right. There you go. Beautiful. Okay, let's stick with Gengar, because we can obviously do damage during rest, and I think that's the right way to go about it. Just feel like this is going to be... Okay, there you go. We knew what was going to happen. We planned for it, okay? We knew what was happening. Let's go Dream Eater. That's going to do way more than Psybeam. Actually, not that much more. God, this is going to take ages, isn't it? Fucking hell. I've got how annoying we're supposed to fight. <laughs> We've been here for quite some time. Especially if we're going to try and catch the bloody thing. Oh, god damn you. God damn you. I mean, worst case scenario, we swap out to Kadabra. We just get it low. His body slam. Shall I chuck a ball now? We just go for it? No, oh, because he's healing back up, though. It's, it's almost certainly immediately going to use rest, isn't it? So, you know what? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to gamble on the ball now. It's almost certainly not going to catch it, but hey. I think I will swap to Kadabra. Yeah, I thought it might be the case. Yep, there you go. Right, so let's go to... Let's just go for a heavy hitter. Let's just go for a heavy hitter. Thank you, Gengon. Appreciate that. You did great work. The 
Look at him. What a child of a Pokemon. Snore. Ooh. Okay, and then our uh, low sweep. Ho 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 ho. Now ball it. Okay. Don't you do it. I'll try ball again. I can't even use a log ball, actually, can I? Okay, fair enough. Come on. Oh. Oh. Beautiful. Hey, that was easier than I thought. I was a little worried that was going to take a long, long time. But uh, that was that was all right. Did that say Barnstable leveled up? Oh. How are you allowed to submit that as a sprite? <laughs> How are you allowed to submit that as a sprite? Come on, now. Come on. Okay, let's go with, um... God, there's a lot of Snorlax. Oh, that one's Big Boy. Let's go with that one. Big Boy. Beautiful. Uh, Storm in the PC. Do I want to give a slot? No, I'm probably not going to use that, to be honest with you. Storm in Box 1, and... No evolution. Why? Barnstable. Oh, he's already... Uh, I'm an idiot. Don't. I don't know what I'm talking about. I don't know what I'm talking about. Right, so what quests have we got active? I've missed some, haven't I? People were saying I've got to go back to the tower in, uh... In Viridian, to be honest with you, I, uh, the, the, the lighthouse. I'll be honest, I'm I'm annoyed by the uh, the effect we've got going on at the edge of the screen. Oh, Bianca, I you're like a character, aren't you? Here's something from the region I come from. Castellia Cones. I don't know what that is. I recognize the name. I don't know who the character is. I presume it's an anime character. No idea, couldn't tell you. Uh, oh, of course, it's the bike path. Fastball. Ooh, now you're all right. Why is the machine talking to me? It's cursed future. So we can go this way. I guess we'll just go for the actual bike path proper then. You head into Fuchsia City. We should probably get a psychic Pokemon up front in that case. Yeah, this is going to take a long time, isn't it? <laughs> oh, God. Special attack, Rose. Okay, that's good. That's good. This seems like a good power to have. I, I actually think this is all right. So, hold on. Upgrade. I should look up where we get that. I wonder if it's like a... It looks like he's wearing his pants on his head. I wonder if that's from Johto, because that's where it originally was. But then again, like... Like what? The, uh, the, the dubious disc is Gen 4, if I'm not mistaken. Oh, God. We are cruel. You're very cruel doing that. Look at that poor thing. Good God. Actually, you know what? Gengon's going to do pretty well here, I think. I think we'll leave him up front. Let me look up where we get this upgrade, just to see if we can get a... Honestly, let's just see if we can get a... Uh... Oh, Joseph's evolving. Ursa Ring. No. No. Because we know it can definitely evolve every level. I don't know what... Uh... Oh. Is Hone just stone? Something just... Something just uh, creeped its way into my mind. Light blue ever stone. Is it a... It's like a stone, isn't it? It's a, it's a dusk stone or something. How do I get one of those? Moon? It's not moonstone. I I think we need a stone to get into Age of Slash. Hold on. No shit. Apparently, at this point in the game, we can go to Saffron and take the train. We, we've always been able to go to Saffron, I suppose. We can take the train from Saffron to Goldenrod, and apparently the Goldenrod department store sells them. Damn. I presume we'd only be allowed in Goldenrod. That seems a bit weird that we'd be able to jump to Johto like that. Maybe they don't do it like Gen 2 does, where you beat the Elite Four, then you go to uh, Kanto. Maybe maybe in this game, it's just like, you can just go there when you can go there, right? And you just kind of progress through. Okay, hold on. Let's go, because we didn't do that with, with the Elite Sin Sound playthrough. Can I just, like, scroll the map over then? No, see? Interesting. Let's... Oh, let's, let's finish the bike path, because we're already here. Let's get the Pokemon Center unlocked in Fuchsia. Did she just say she'll steal all my money? Did he just say he'll steal all my money, Jamal? What the hell? Okay, right, let's kill you dead for a start. Unbelievable. I do the stealing around here, not you. Presuming it's exclusively Eevees that I trade away. They didn't even really steal it. They gave it to me. They were kind of asking for us to trade that away. It was a gift, Your Honor. I don't speak Pokemon language that they speak in Celadon City, so I just thought they were gifting it to me. I was Incredible defense. Unbelievable. Bogola Jamal is about to send out Meow Chu. Uh, okay. Well, uh, we'll stick with it. Hideous. <laughs> Hideous. I want to give Gengon a fair shake. 
He's like not... Oh, okay. Very good. He's not very good right now. <coughs> I need to look up where we get that upgrade. I feel like I've just got a worse Gengar. It's my own fault. God damn, what the fuck is this thing kicking my ass? Dual chop it. Payday. We love the payday. I get to take the money, right? In this case. Uh, level 30. Okay. Burglar Jamal is defeated. Very good. Oh, Dratos is evolving. Okay. Okay. Custom sprite. Ooh. Actually, possibly, maybe. Hold on. Yes. Oh. Thank you, Mr. Wazzy. You've, 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 you've put us on a redemption arc. Shellfish, dragon, Pokemon. What level is Dragonite? Was that like 45? Something insane. Oh, the ghosts are following me. I can't escape my past. I'm actually going to avoid like most of these fights. I'm not going to lie. I'm actually way more interested in getting some of these quests resolved. Because this screen effect, as, as interesting as it is, it is a reminder of my own mortality. And a reminder of my own mistakes that I'm almost certain to pay for in hell. Uh, Thunderbolt. Bad day to be you, my friend. I was like, maybe it's... Maybe it's psychic. And then again, I guess when it's slow choke. One day I'll remember how this game works. <laughs> Cue ball Zeke. Why were they called that originally? Because they were bald. These people have hair. What is the name of the biker gang? The cue balls. It's not very imposing, is it? Hi there. Running down the cycling road was a ton of fun. No, it was not. Whoa, you startled me. You seem pretty good at stinking up on people. You perfectly move sucker punch. Um. No. We'll bear that in mind, though. I might... Fuck's sake. I might want that in the future. It's twice that's got me now. And here we are. Fuchsia. Nope, Route 18. Not quite Fuchsia yet. I'll have to come back and do all these fights. Technically, it's backtracking, so maybe I'll be all right with us doing it on double speed. I want to get some actual progress, you know. Right, here we are. I would like to rest my Pokemon. You're right. I wonder if there's another Flute guy that I've missed as well. I feel like I've... I feel like I've missed a lot in Celadon, but I'm not sure I actually have. Paris is abundant in the Safari Zone. That's great news. Hello? You're a Pokemon trainer. Want me to teach you the move Iron Head? No, thank you. Okay. Where the... Where the water meets the sand? What was it? I think that's a tenacious dealer. What? What's this? Can't go this way. Not allowed. Okay. Something for the future. What are these? Oh! It's a Pokemon. Oh, my God. What the... F what the fuck is that? Sandy Ghast. What is that? That's not a real Pokemon. No way. What is this Sandy Ghast? I killed that one. <laughs> okay, so we're looking for a house, I think, in Fuchsia. We're looking for, like, a bed. Ooh, could it be here? Please do try to keep your voice down to not just my Munchara. Do I know about hidden abilities? Yes. Thank you. Okay, peer peek into the dream world. I'm able to locate a Pokemon with rare abilities. This Pokemon around Area 3 might have a hidden ability. Oh, in the Safari Zone, right. So it could be there? I mean, that'd be kind of appropriate, I suppose. Ooh, what is that? Shiny, shiny Abra? Macho, give me... Is that a shiny Abra? Is that the implication there? Or is it just teleporting around? Your Macho's giving you back massage. It's weird. Okay. Let's go and have a look around. It could just be the hotel. Do you think we could take on Koga? Probably not. I think he would probably uh, absolutely steamroll me. Ooh, what is in here? Oh, it's a back garden. Hi there. They look so tired from all that fighting. You should let me groom them while you relax by the pool. Sure. Uh, you can groom... <laughs> this one. <laughs> Victory Tress looks a lot happier and prettier now. Great. I guess that's just if you want like a crowbat or whatever. Fair enough. I presume it increases friendship, that is. Okay. Hi there. How are you doing? Koga, this town's gym leader got approached, but he had to turn down the... Oh, by the Elite Four. Yep, fair enough. He was in the Elite Four in... Uh, in uh, Generation 2, right? It's like his his daughter or something, or his, his niece that takes over. Uh, how to are people to give you something good? Okay. My current quests are very cursed, so... God, bloody hell, this is busy. Sitting by the water's edge in the Safari Zone, dipping my toes in the light. What's up? He bit my toe. Must have had a really sharp tooth for how much it hurt. I love hanging by the Safari Zone's light. No, I don't dare go back there unless I know what bit me. I'm trying to find the sharp tooth Pokemon that bit this man. Probably a Gyarados. Okay. Hi there. Bunch of Grimers have started appearing on the Cyclone Road. It's quite unsanitary. Get rid of them myself. I don't know how to fight. Because you have to get rid of all the Grimer on the Cyclone Road. Okay. 
We're going to go back to Psycho Road anyway, so that works pretty well. Find poor Chansey over by the Safari Zone. Okay, find the Chansey. Find the Chansey's trainer. Be my best time in the Cycle Road. Nope. I, I think we'll have to beat all the trainers before we can do that. I mean, I could accept it and just not do it, right? Uh, sure. Oh. Uh, okay, good, good, good. It just accepts the quest, but doesn't chuck us under the, under the bus quite yet. Fair enough. Okay. Let's go track down this bloody feather then. Very annoyed of being haunted all the time. <laughs> what was that? Is that Scream Flecker? What was that about? Ooh. Might just be a render bug. Um, okay. Let's go and have a look around at high speed then. Do we go in here? Uh, ooh. Oh, it's, uh, this is the person. Specialized in poison type Pokemon, just like my father and my grandfather before him. But the train Golbat. Do you have one? I'll trade you a Glagar for it. Nope. You've got a Zubat right there. What do you mean? I guess... Maybe she wants to train two at once. What do I? What, what, what am I supposed to know? Okay. Where is this feather gonna be then? I thought it was quite obvious which beds had it, but I guess not. Let's buy some Ultra Balls. Oh, we can buy Ultra Balls here, can we? Oh, that's great news. I, that what that guy said is not. Uh, Ultra Balls. Oh, good shit. Okay, let's stock up then, squad. I'm actually just gonna buy a hundred. <laughs> Keep us going for a while, huh? Okay, good shit. Thank you. No, I'm good. That was that was a good idea to come here first. I'm happy I did it. Right. Uh, maybe we'll just let some time skip by then, and I'll see if I can track down this freaking feather. Because what time is it now? Yeah, 9 a.m. We should probably just go get a hotel room. Oh! It's right here! Oh my god, it was like right here in the hotel room. Voice echo from somewhere. Find the next feather. Oh... Oh, we're being we're getting we're getting even more spooked. We're gonna have to find some ghosts now, aren't we? Guess we'll run around until one turns up. Little ghost. Oh, there's one in the pool. I can't get back there, ghost. You should have spawned in more convenient place. Hello there. Right, next weather then. A voice echoed from somewhere. Find the next one inside the lone house at the city at the edge of civilization. Cinnabar? It's either Cinnabar or wherever this place is. Crimson City. Some sort of edgy place. Okay. We need surf to get there. So do we do we do we try and like really get this quest done like out the way and then tidy up the stuff I've missed? Cuz surf if I'm not mistaken is just safari zone, right? So we could probably just get that today. Let's give it a fucking go. Why are they wearing like army uniforms? What have you got? Safari souvenir. Those are teeth. All right, so Okay. What what does that do? <laughs> Those are just dentures. <laughs> Honey. Oh, fusion incense. No, you're good. Am I allowed to play right now? I, I've only just turned up. Oh, cool. Yes, I'm going to do this, and we're just going to blitz through and just go get surf. Is it the same layout as normal? If so, I know which way to go. I guess we'll find out, won't we? Oh, God, the ghosts follow me in. Fucking hell. Let's see if we can find the way through then, shall we? I'm only here for surf. If I'm not mistaken, it's, it's based on... Um, oh, hello, fella. What a polite guy. It's based on uh, steps taken, not actually the, uh, the the time limit, if I'm if I'm correct. Right, so let's go up. There's fucking ghosts everywhere. My guy. <laughs> you want to go this way? Again, I think I vaguely remember it. I'm, I'm going only off of Gen 1's direction. I could be going completely wrong. Poison Barb. Oh, that's quite cool. We'll have to do a couple of runs of the Savaris. There's a couple of Pokemon I want in here. Okay. I think it's this way. I may be wrong. I know which map we've got to get to. I just don't remember the way to bloody get there. This way? Area 4 is the right area, but I think we want to be on the other side, don't we? Ooh, okay, let's see. It's like up there. Am I in the wrong place? I think I'm in the wrong place. Oh, no. What the hell? Oh, it's Persian. Hello. I wonder what the hell it was. Yeah, I'm in the wrong area. Oh, I'm sorry. I've let you all down. We won't have to do this twice. On the plus side, it counts as backtracking at that point, so uh, we can double speed it. <laughs> Listen, you got to live by your own rules. <sighs> catch a pincer because they're cursed. I'm just going to chuck a ball, see if, it, see if it goes. If we don't catch, we don't catch it. Should I chuck a rock at it? Fuck it, chuck a rock at it. Is there a strategy to, like, maximizing Safari Zone output? Oh, this is the wrong way. I'll get that in a future run. 
I want to get Surf quickly so that we can cure our haunting. Yeah, I was well out. Okay, sorry, my bad. We might not be able to do it in this run. I may have messed this up. Okay, so we do want to go up there. So I'm trying to avoid the grass too much, but it's actually the way we need to be. Fucking get out the way, my guys. Okay, we we'll probably will. You never know, we might get lucky come across a Kangaskhan or a, or a Chansey. They're both uh, the rare ones, aren't they? Ding dong, tomorrow game is over. Fuck you. Fuck you, I'll see you tomorrow. Right, let's do double time then. My bad. We'd have done that easily. I just I just got unlucky at the end there. Right. Speedrun tactics. Here we go. Fuck you, grass. Avoid the grass. Actually, it's going to be quite tight then, isn't it? Oops. Well... <laughs> That's what you get playing on double speed. I guess we get a free Psyduck. <laughs> I didn't want that. I really... Uh, there's got to be some funny... Oh, what the hell's that? Whoa. I don't like... I don't like the way that one's drawn. That freaks me out. It's the wrong art style. Uh, I like that one. He's a happy little guy. Happy little guy's going to spend the rest of eternity in that Pokebox. Never to be seen again. It's a Venonat. I took a ball. Honestly, anything we haven't caught, let's just... Let's just ball it. It's gone. Right. Careful. You've wasted a lot of steps by doing this at double speed. So just bear that in mind. Parasite ball it. Boom. Oh, god damn it. I thought I thought I got it then. Which way was it? Was it up? It was up here. That I, I remember. We're good. I didn't want that. <laughs> More haste, less speed. More speed, less haste. One or the other. Come on. I don't want a venonat. Go. All I want is surf. We've got to be Koga to actually use Surf, though, correct? Ooh, Venomoth is fun. Don't want that either. Oh, God's sake. I didn't even move. It's the same Venomoth. Right, area three. Up here, cross here, down here, cross up. Good shit. We're getting there. We're getting there. This is the one. Oh, he's a, oh, he's a parish, par, par, Parisian. Someone from Parisia. Come on now. Pin where I want. Ball it. Lots of cursed potential with a pincer. I mean, why not make it again, you know? This might need to just go single speed, and I just edit it out, and we just go slow. Like right there. Boom, found it. Hi there. The first person in the secret house. Congratulations, you won. We got surf. Beautiful. Okay. Good shit. I don't know what level Koga's gonna be. He's probably gonna wipe the floor with us. It's a white rock. It sure is. Does it not do anything? I'm surprised that old bloke doesn't want me to come pick some bloody flowers from here. Oh, well, actually, can we poke your on this? Oh, you can. Lickitung. Very high curse potential. Lickitung pincer could be horrible to see. Speak his name and it shall appear. It's like the devil. Lickitung pincer, like a tongue erupting from his dirty mouth. Okay, I might, uh, I might try it. Uh, it's gonna be horrible. Boom, got it. Okay, that's half the half the curse combo. You love to see it. Ooh, there's a lot of sprites. Oh my god, look at that one. Ah, uh, they're all good. I like that one. It's got a lot of pride. Okay, um, that, there is a chance available here, so we'll just have a look around. We'll give it, we'll give it a go. Bye. We'll waste the last of our steps just doing this this last one. Scyther, I'd like. Go on. I feel like there's a lot of good Caesar combinations. caesar has got, like, style points. Probably a lot of good edgy Caesar combinations as well. Lickitung. Please. Ah! Just trust the system. Shit. Well, I pushed it too far. Maybe you should immediately open up Rock and... For fuck's sake, immediately get a Parasect. I don't want a Parasect. These are all getting one to trade it away. Come on, show me the chancy though. Venonat, we haven't got one. We'll catch it. I'm not gonna fill out the whole Pokedex, but I'm not. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna commit to it. Okay, we've done a lot of long, overbearing series on this channel that have outstayed their welcome. Skyrim. I'm not gonna suggest that I will catch all of them, but we might as well if we've got. I mean, it's free to try, isn't it? Boom. Okay. We're good. Very nice. Yep. Great. Don't care about execute. Show me the chancy though. What is that? What the fuck? What the hell is that thing? Venipede? Is that fusion? I guess we'll find out. <laughs> we're catching it. It's so easy. Oh my god. 
Okay. Show me the chancy. You're really pissing me off here. Come on. I'm not coming back. I mean, I'll come back and collect all the items. There's obviously a lot of good stuff here. Never heard of that before in my life. Ooh, Kangaskhan. The rare one. You know, I had to do it. I had to do it. I feel like throwing the rock is, is not the right maneuver. How many more steps have we got? Oh, 24 left. Okay. Need arena? Sorry, you've already been beaten to the punch there. Okay, we've probably got one last encounter. Egg, egg arena. I hate that. It's got yolk in its ear. Okay, that's going to be the last one, I think. What if you stand still and just wiggle back and forth? Sweet scent. I suppose that's it's as if you're really trying to maximize your safari zone investment. Horrible. Thing though. Right, we're good. Okay. Honestly, great work today, squad. I would I would love to try and take on Koga. I think we will just get our ass handed to us. I've, I've sped through a lot of stuff. So tomorrow's episode is going to be a cleanup episode. We'll go back. We'll do the quests that I've missed. Again, if I have missed anything, please let me know. At me on Discord in the Pokemon channel if there is anything, you know, important that I've missed. And we'll, uh, I, I, I do keep a list open on my other monitor. So we've got the Vermilion City stuff that we've still got to, still got to patch up and sort out. Is that, sorry, what is this thing? I feel like I recognize it, but I don't know. Summary. It's just a Venipede. Oh. It's some, it's, some, it's some future generation Pokemon that I don't understand. All right, fair enough. If you've got any feedback on the fusions, again, all ears. We've got a dedicated channel to it over in the Discord, which I do read through. Let me know there. See you all next time. Bye, bye, bye.